this is the 8th of September 2010 and we have in our clinic today a patient who has been diagnosed as having TB of the spine. In the days earlier we used to call it POTS disease and uh, it was a painful condition where it is characterized by night pain. A patient who was suffering from such a condition they used to have severe pain and they couldn't bend down uh, from their knee. Uh, they had to bend down in order to pick up anything that used to fall on the ground and that was called pot spine. It was pathognomic or diagnostic of such a condition of the spine. It was very common in the days earlier, but uh, nowadays it's coming less, uh, less frequent. But in spite of it, one particular thing which I would like every viewer to know is this, that especially for TB of the bones, of the spine especially. DOS is more than a miracle. It's, it's unbelievable in the way in which it gives patients relief from the symptoms and from the disease. I know of people who have been bedridden for one and a half years using private medicines and uh, regularly they have been using it but they have not benefited and uh, their mothers had to take leave and uh, attend to the bedside bedridden people and uh, attend to their uh, uh, toilets and to the motions they didn't they couldn't even go to the toilet they couldn't go to the toilets and they had to depend upon others in order to be given their bed pants and their urinary cans and uh, but such people are there who have been benefited with the dots as soon as they were put on dots, two months of dots used to give them relief from pain. Without taking painkillers, they could sleep throughout the night. And another, within four months of dots, they used to even get up and slowly they started limping and going to their uh, bathrooms for their uh, uh, needs of attending the knee, uh, calls of nature. And uh, within six months, they used to even uh, walk properly. And I know of a person who could, who can even dance now. So this is the way in which dots is especially very, very, very effective, I can say, in uh, TB diseases of the spine, which we call the POTS disease. Here, uh, this uh, lady, a young lady, is very bold enough, and uh, I request you, dear lady, to give a few uh, words of encouragement or whatever is it that you have passed through the past, uh, I should say, from January, you were sick and having pain. Could you tell uh, what you went through and what you are especially experiencing now? Over to you, madam. Hi. And I was suffering with spinal cord uh, problems from Jan and uh, I went to the doctor and where he said that it's a slip disc. But uh, later I had uh, an abscess in my abdomen and again I had to go to care hospital to rule out this. Where they said that it's a it, it's just a, a normal infection but again uh, they had drained it out and for continuously for three months, they every day I used to go for dressing. Again, I they they suspected it was TB, but they have done so many tests on cultures and tests, F, FNAC and everything. But you were covered by insurance, you said, no, for yes. this, so you didn't worry about the expenditure being done. That's true. And uh, were you going to office during all these uh, events, or were you forced to take rest because of the pain? Yes, I, I was forced to take a rest and I was actually bedridden for almost three to four months. Goodness. And uh, I, I never knew that it was uh, it was tuberculosis, okay. that means spinal cord. Okay. And again, I I had a severe backache, so I had to go to an orthopedician and where he suggested me to go for a biopsy. Okay. And then I came to know that uh, it's a spinal cord tuberculosis. Okay, so it's only a biopsy which uh, had uh, uh, given you the inkling that it was tuberculosis. That's true. So, and you were put on private medicines? Mm -hmm. Yeah, what yes. is it? AKT4? It's AKT4 and I used it hardly for 15 days. Did it give you any improvement as soon as you took it? No. Were you taking it daily? Yes. And uh, even if you had, uh, if it was necessary, you could have purchased it because you are caught by insurance, wasn't it? Yeah. Then uh, what made you opt for DOTS, could you say? Uh, my parents, they encouraged me to go to TB hospital and there uh, 
I was diagnosed, uh, I, I was given a correct treatment. And so it was uh, not because of financial inability, but it was your understanding that government provided medicines of high quality alone give you a better result in case of tuberculosis, wasn't it? Yes, that's true. And I agree and I believe and I experience that uh, it's, it's just uh, dots. It helped me to walk today. So you walked? Down. Oh, that's nice. So, but one thing I should ask you, you have used 15 days of uh, private treatment uh, which you purchased. Yes. Uh, can you correlate uh, or any change between the medicines which you used uh, in private and uh, the uh, change which you felt soon after putting yourself upon DOTS medicines? Uh, yes, I could see the change because uh, initially I used to wear echo frame belt and different kinds of belts to uh, make myself comfortable and try to walk. Okay. But uh, as soon as I started taking medicines, within a few days, I could see the great difference in me and I was able to walk by myself and uh, now I'm able to go around, walk, jump and so I can do anything. So this you were not able to do um, earlier? You're, you were you able to sleep in the night without taking painkillers or so? No, I used to take painkillers for about every two or three hours. Goodness, so much! Yes, because I had a very, very severe pain in my back and I was not able to get up from my bed. So now without any painkillers and just within two months I think you have been using dots. Mm -hmm. You've got another yes. four months of uh, dots to go to go by, isn't it? Yes. So by that time you'll not jump, I think you'll do something more than that, you'll fly. Yes, yes I, I believe in dots and uh, as I said I experienced it so I'll definitely go back to my job and start working. You haven't yet started still madam? No, uh, I was uh, suggested to take bed rest. Okay. For yeah, you better don't uh, put uh, lift weights or something. Yes. And though you said you can jump, please don't be so joyful in dancing that you do that uh, yes. much. And I'm happy that you are imp you have improved. And uh, I wish you all the best to complete your full course of treatment without uh, absenting or defaulting. And please encourage us in this work which we are doing. And uh, uh, please let your people also know everyone around you of the wonderful way in which dots work and people. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.